everybody, this is Eric Warrior, and welcome to NetworkMarketingPro.com. And today I want to talk to you about an interesting topic because anybody that's involved in network marketing, they get sometimes frequently, sometimes infrequently, uh, sometimes all the time, depending on their posture, they get this, I am not interested in network marketing. Is this one of those MLM things? Because if it is, I am not interested. Anybody ever get a thought like that or get a comment like that from somebody that you talked to that you didn't maybe expect it from or something that maybe you did expect it from? Here's what they're saying when they say that. Uh, or here's the reality behind uh, that statement. You know what it means 99% of the time? They tried it themselves and didn't have success. Either themselves or a very close family member got involved and did not have the success that they wanted so they swore it off they said you know what that's it I've had it one percent of the time is somebody who gets approached all the time and have not tried it but 99 percent of the time the person who says it to you has had an experience themselves probably got involved with a lottery mentality like we talk about so much they probably got involved trying to get something for nothing trying to get a free ride trying to involve a few people and sit back and, and um, wait for the money to come in. Very, very few actually went through the work of becoming a professional because if you become a professional, failure is not part of your options. It's only success, different levels of success depending on your professionalism. So um, here's what I like to do when people say, is this one of those MLM things? Because if it is, I am not interested. My response, and I would, I, I would ask you to use this also. Um, I think you'll have a lot of fun with it. And I think you'll find some amazing things happen from it. When somebody says, I am not interested in MLM, if they give me the hand, I say, oh, you have a story. What's your story? Tell me what happened. You got involved, didn't you? And something happened, didn't it? Tell me what happened. Tell me your story. Did the company go out of business? Did you not have the success selling that you thought you were going to have? Did you think you were going to bring some people in and they didn't come in? How long ago was this? What company was it? What happened? Tell me the story. Tell me the story. And let them tell you the story. And through that, they will basically, through the, uh, the telling of the story, they will admit, you know what, I just didn't work it. Or you know what? I only did it for a few weeks and it didn't work out for me. Or you know what, I didn't really do the homework I needed to do. Or you know what, I didn't give it the time. Or you know what, this, 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 this. And you'll get past this automatic reflex reaction of not interested. This, uh, what they're using as a defense mechanism against their own hopes and dreams. Because acknowledging the actual story of what they really went through is something that will open their eyes to the fact that there is a better opportunity out there. They just didn't approach it right the first time around. Here's what I know. Anybody who says they're burnt out about network marketing, I never believe that story. Ever, ever, ever. You know why? They have hopes and dreams and aspirations and they want to get their hopes up. Again, they're just afraid of doing it. Um, our job is to help them get past that fear because anybody who's joined once you get this in your blood and it's something that no other profession can ever offer um, the excitement of growth and a meaningful interaction with other people and making a difference not only in the organization but with the products and services that you offer and the connection with people around the world and all the different things that, that uh, our great profession offers to people. So next time somebody says network marketing, not interested. Ask them, you have a story. What's your story? Tell me what happened. When was it? How long ago? What happened? Give me the details. How long were you involved? What did you do? What, you know, or, or, or was it you or was it a close family member? And you will find that they will all kind of let down, tell you their story. And then you can have a real conversation about how the fact that the profession has changed dramatically, about how the fact that if they picked a bad company, they don't have to you know, it's not the profession's fault or if they had a product that wasn't a valuable product, that there's lots of great valuable products today, um, you can have at least a conversation to be able to move down that road. 
So, ladies and gentlemen, my wish for you is that you decide to become a network marketing professional, that you decide to go pro. It is a stone-cold fact, no matter what anybody says, that we have a better way. Now let's go tell the world. Everybody, I'll see you tomorrow, and have a great day. Bye-bye.